How's she going, my son, and welcome back to Undertale Genocide. As you can hear, we've significantly screwed up everything in the ruins. The only thing between us and the outside world is Goat Mom now. <sighs> this is gonna suck. This is gonna suck. Friggin' run of it in, please. <laughs> when can I go home? How to exit the ruins. Huh. That's not the fact she gave me last time. Interesting. I wonder how many he put in. calls you out if you go down here by yourself. Oh well. You should know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be, good now be a good child and go upstairs. Oh, it's far too late for that, I'm afraid. Good child and this playthrough do not have any intersection whatsoever. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. No. You can't make me. You want to leave so badly? Huh. You were just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you were strong enough to survive. You're gonna regret making me do this. Then again. Even if you let me through, I'd probably still have to kill you. Holy shit! What? It one-shot her! For like five digits, what the- Oh god, I was not expecting that. I was expecting it to still be a boss fight, but like... Maybe she'd chew you out a bit or something? Like, oh my god. Oh, and I know this little bastard's gonna have fun with this comment. With this whole turn of events. Oh man. <laughs> you're not really human, are you? No, you're empty inside, just like me. In fact, you're Mike, right? Yeah. We're still inseparable after all these years. Listen, I have a plan to become all-powerful. Even more powerful than you and your stolen soul. Let's destroy everything in this wretched world. Everyone. Everything in these worthless memories. Let's turn them all to dust. That's a wonderful idea! Whoa.
I wonder if it, I wonder if it's Toby doing the voice work on that little bit of dialogue that was voiced. And the Metaton, oh yes, that we that we heard in the previous playthrough. Twenty-two kills. Man, oh man. Sands, you you aren't the scariest thing in this forest anymore. I am. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Still funny. <laughs> Your cue to laugh, yeah, it's not laughing. Or, uh, to emote at all? Gee, lady, you really know how to pick them, huh? Okay, that's fine. Everyone's got their own sense of humor. I'm Sans, Sans the Skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, right, go through. My brother made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. I don't bother. Uh, okay, I guess you don't have to. Oh my god. Sans, have you found a human yet? Yeah. Really? Wowee. I guess that's settled. That worked out, huh? Are you just gonna stare at me, or...? Yeah. Well, I'll be straightforward with you. Our brothers really like to see a human. So, you know, you really helped me out if you kept pretending to be one. Ow! That cut deep. Also, this music isn't too bad. It's a little warped, but it's not like super creepy. 16 left. Not gonna need that. I'll hang on to the bandage. It's not very ice to meet you, and it's not gonna be very ice to meet me in a minute. I forgot you had to bash Z for the tough glove. It's been a while. Now, I was told by a buddy who watched the first episode that I don't have to, like, kind of grind in a circle, but I just I just have to avoid not hitting a boss fight until I finished the genocide. So, you know... Sands, when's the human showing up? I want to look my Sunday best. Or at least my Tuesday pretty good. Oh god, he's still he's still naive as ever. Don't you only have one outfit? Yeah, but I could style my hair. 
Oh, right. Good idea. Say, why don't you look over there? Ah, uh, the little bit of levity. It helps. Sands! Oh my god! I'm dizzy. What am I looking at? Behold! Oh my god! Why are you telling me to look at a rock? <laughs> hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! I have no idea what that is. Well, it's not a rock. Not a rock? Oh no! By process of elimination! That means it's a human! Ahem! Human! Prepare yourself! For hijinks! For lowjinks! Dangers! Puzzles! Capers! Japers! Being captured! And other sorts of fun activities! Refreshments will be provided! If you dare! <laughs> and you don't even bat an eye, huh? Oh, fuck Sands! Dude, this is hard enough as it is! I don't need you fucking... Fucking cutting deep like that! Damn! I never liked your hat. I can't stop shivering all of a sudden. Oh god. God, he barks. All right, he, his doesn't change. It's been a while. Man, it's getting kind of harsh. I am a snowman. I cannot move. Traveler, if you could, you got the snowman piece. Oh god, I just took it from him! Oh, I don't have enough room for anything more. I'm gonna go get more. I need, um, I need to spend time just killing things anyway, so might as well double back, why not? Oh man, that sentence coming out of my mouth just now, that, uh, that really hammered home what the genocide playthroughs kind of makes you feel. I don't need that anymore. Put one of them away. Yeah, that's fine. Um, yep. Put a bunch of these away. You know, this music kind of reminds me of, like, a really jazzy smoking lounge. Oh god, I gotta kill the lesser dog too, don't I? No. And I leveled. Huzzah. My LV has gone up. Defense isn't going up a whole lot still. I have a base defense stat now, though, unlike the pacifist run through, so it goes up eventually. Just not a lot. I guess if they made you too tough, there'd be no challenge, because then you would just be invincible. Oh me, oh my, what are you doing? Soon there won't be any of me left. Oop. Oh no, he's... Oh god. Stop, please. Blit. A useless pile of snow. With one little carrot. Yep. You're so lazy! You were napping all night! I think that's called... Sleeping. Excuses, excuses. Oh ho, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. I'm just walking right through it. For you see, this is the invisible... Uh... Hmm. You must be having culture shock. You see, where I come from, it's a loving tradition to suffer through horrible puzzles for no reason. 
So, uh, just walk back there and... Uh, why couldn't we get a human that likes puzzles? Oh... Wait, so there never was a puzzle there? <laughs> Is that what I'm getting? I must be. It would make my brother happy if you played along. Oh, no. And well, this guy isn't going to be there because <laughs> I don't deserve ice cream. Not going to bother playing with the ball. I always get a kick out of the colors on the side there being wrong. Although, maybe I should kick a ball in. Take the edge off a little bit. But also... See if... There's a genocide message or something. Yeah, come on, Mr. Snowball. Get... Oh no! Purple. Even though you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of the ball. You were awarded 2G. Okay. Whatever. Human! I hope you're ready for... Sans! Where's the puzzle? It's right there. On the ground. Trust me. There's no way they'll skip this one. Sans! That did nothing! Whoops. I knew I should have you put down Junior Jumble instead. What? Junior Jumble? Finally! Something we can both agree on! Guess you don't like word searches, huh? Me neither. I'm more of a funny pages kind of guy. It's a note from Papyrus. Human! Please enjoy this spaghetti! Little do you know, this spaghetti is a trap. Designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing? Thoroughly jeeped again by the great Papyrus! Yeah! <laughs> papyrus. It's played frozen spaghetti, so gold stuck to the table. Unplug microwave, all the settings say spaghetti. Thirteen left. Thankfully they don't make me kill the mouse, because I, I think I couldn't do it if I had to kill the mice too. There's a switch here. It's been depressed with vines. Okay, so apparently he's on my side now? Because I'm a murdering asshole? Right on. <laughs> I guess. Wait, why does the... Chill Drake... What? That's new. Oh, well, first of all, I'll get rid of you. Oh god, maybe not. Oh god. Ah! Okay, I think Jerry has to die last, because... I've never seen a chill drink before! Is that genocide specific, or is that just really rare and I missed it? Gotcha. What monster riot? Flaking apart. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no, not act. Old habits. <laughs> oh, gross. Ah! <laughs> Friggin' whatever the hell you are. I think I'm doing everyone a favor killing you. <laughs> Come on. Ugh. 
trying to murder you. Why are you so goddamn resilient? There we go. Jeez, they get a lot of money for being a murdering asshole. Kind of makes sense, I guess. You're taking everything they got rather than them giving you maybe like pocket change or something when you, uh, you know, appease them. Ugh. Hello. Your smell. Identify your smell. It's that weird smell. Makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! I'm gonna try to weave... Thread the needle a little bit. Misery awaits you. Ah! Oh god, I think I enraged her. Yeah, I did. Tugress is on the warpath. Chop you in half! Oh god, she's pissed. <laughs> I mean, I did just kill her husband, I'm not surprised, but... Okay, I think I'll double back. It's good enough excuse as any to keep random encounters coming, plus... I'm really worried about using up my resources on this playthrough, because, like, I don't even know if I'm gonna get vendors in this, right? Because they're all monsters! They wouldn't want to have anything to do with me! Because I'm killing everyone! <laughs> God damn. Oh? Did they just not bother? I guess they just didn't bother. Yep, they just didn't bother. Hey! It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle! It was made by the great... Are you serious? Sans! Help! They keep walking through my puzzles! They're supposed to let me explain them! Then threaten and baffle them with dangerous japes! Well, maybe they don't like japes. Everyone likes japes! What about Undyne? Doesn't she hate puzzles? She hates puzzles, but she loves japes. That makes sense. Human! What do you think? Puzzles or japes? Okay, this is normally the part where you either agree or disagree. And depending on your answer, we say something great in response. Here, why don't you do this puzzle yourself? Hey, puzzles might be fun if you tried them. Oh. Eligible chicken scratch. Machine isn't working. It's a pile of mushy snow. Where of dog, please pet bot. Yeah, that's... Because I killed him! Ten left. Okay. I'm trying to remember what screen is next. Okay, this one. Snow Papyrus. Lump of snow with sands written on it in red marker. Do I have to solve the puzzle still? Nope. It's all for me. Little house. What's up? Say, are you following me? Maybe. house down there. Heard there's an extra counter in here. Gotta be like... It's like... I think the encounter is like only considered on the grass or something? I don't know. I don't know. Probably wouldn't count anyway. Okay, 
Okay, that's where the greater dog is. I don't know if he... Oh, crap. Didn't think that had happened. Um, I don't know if he counts as a boss for the purposes of... Um, uh, for the purposes of, like, you know, you have to kill everything by this point for genocide. So I'm gonna, like, just kind of do laps, I guess, to uh, find more people to murder. God, that sentence coming out of my mouth doesn't sound right. And, um... And then do it, because, well, yeah, right after him is Snowden, so... Yeah, if you want the changes to be in Snowden, you'd have to have killed everything first. I mean, that makes the most sense. Ugh. Why do I have the feeling this is the same kind of logic that goes through the head of an actual serial murderer? <laughs> oh. This playthrough isn't any fun. <laughs> and, yet, uh, and yet I'm laughing and smiling, but it's like, nervous, like... Oh god, I'm doing something horrible. Why am I doing this kind of laughter? So I guess the music has just permanently changed to the genocide track? Because I'm on that path? I mean, that's a good indication, I guess. Would be nice if I got some random encounters, so I can murder them. There's little ten of you bastards out here, come on. Don't go freaking hiding on me now. Actually, a bit of this is probably going to be me spinning in circles, <laughs> because, like, there's not any real difference. Although, actually, that's not true. There is one thing I could do. There is one encounter I should try to get, because I should try to get all of them to see what it's like when you they react to you being a genocidal maniac. Um, oh, God. Again. Why am I saying these things? <laughs> Why should I want to do this? Ugh. Oh, morbid curiosity. I have to know. It's going to tie up my brain otherwise. I won't be able to do anything else with my life until I figure this shit out. I mean, I could just look it up, but... That kind of defeats the purpose of it being in the game in the first place. And again, if I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it right. And that means doing it myself. with apparently having Flowey in my corner. Yay? I'm very confused. I'm not sure if I should be happy about that or not. Even though, knowing who he actually is, I'm not going to spoil anything for Pacifist. Um, people who haven't watched the Pacifist playlist yet, which you should, because that's much more uh, war heartwarming than this. <laughs> it's not, you know, it's not genocide. It's not uh, little, vaguely Simpsons yellow person running around murdering innocent monsters. It's, uh... You know, a lot more light-hearted and silly. Come on, give me a gift trot. Give me a gift trot encounter, come on. There we go. God, why is his mouth sideways? Me alone. <laughs> God darn G teenage googly eyes. I've seen other people do this who like didn't know the encounter. And I just like, oh my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> and cruel because I'm about to kill him. <laughs> oh. oh I just had to do it at least once. <laughs> Oh, you gotta find your own fun when you're a psychopath, I guess. Gotta find your own fun. Uh, I guess I'll meander back to it. That is a very well done little annoying dog statue <laughs> made out of snow. Oh, okay, I guess I'll just be at this save point then. I'll do the rest of the grinding off camera, save you some time, save you some trouble. Uh, thank you so much for watching this horrible, horrible playthrough. Um, 
Twitter's in the description as usual. The subscription will be the save point as usual. I might start experimenting with putting a save point in like a little corner of the, or not a save point, but a, a subscription somewhere in the little corner of the screen out of the way so it's there the whole video. So that, you know, like you don't have to wait till the whole end of the video to subscribe. Probably put some in the description or two stuff too. You know, little YouTube things to try to get people to stick around and watch more content. Um, whether or not I enjoy producing it or not. <laughs> uh yeah, this this whole genocide playthrough. This is a this is a very big kick to the male genitalia right now. I can tell you that. Oh, but anyway, with that in mind, uh, there's only eight of them left in this level. So ciao for now.